Namaste. Hi. The clues to gaining access to the deeper points or realms of the inner body are all printed on the external body. For today, let me talk about the sacral lumbar region, the hips. All right. So the back of the hips, yeah, inside towards the back, yeah, is connected to the outer heel. All right. So by massaging and tracing the bones of the outer heel, yeah, you influence and massage the nerves connected as well you know, to the back of the hips. Yeah. So you can use your hands, yeah, you can use your fingers and then just tracing the bones there. Or you can use a roller, yeah, such as this. Yeah. Yeah. You're rubbing, yeah, you can do it standing, yeah, inside, yeah, and then maybe pressing, yeah, the edges of the heel. All right, or massage the whole foot, yeah, and then focusing on that, yeah, outer edges of the heel. All right, also, yeah, the back of the hips, yeah, you can gain access by rubbing the tongue inside the mouth from the cheek down to the chin and then to the other side. Yeah. And then the tongue, yeah, can gain also access where to the back of the shoulders, yeah. And then when you rub the tongue upwards, yeah, it targets the front towards the pubic bone. Similarly, here, yeah, the inside of the heel. Yeah, so it's connected yeah, to what? The tongue is connected to yeah, the front of the hips. So when you rub the tongue upwards, yeah, it predominantly regulates and influences the front, the front of the shoulder, the front of the hips, yeah, and then the front of the heel, the inside also gains access to the front of the hips, yeah, and the front of the shoulders. Now, really, those circular, you know, the rounded yeah, um, shapes, so the rounded body parts we have, they are all connected to those inner pockets, yeah, round, yeah, circular, yeah. So also in the in the chest and in the abdomen walls, yeah, all of them are connected. Yeah, it's just circle. Yeah, so when you do and then trace the circular flow of the body, yeah, you also gain access to those compartments in the circular motion, in the hips, yeah, and in all body parts, which yeah, form the shape of the circle. Yeah, you can use them to massage those points. All right, to give you further information, yeah, the indentation yeah, here in the knees, yeah, they're connected to the eyes, yeah, the circle there, the, this is circular, yeah, hole there, like there's an empty yeah, spot there, yeah, if you just pinch them and give them some gentle rubbing, yeah, those uh, points also influence the nerves connected to our optic tracts, yeah, and here, the cheek, yeah, yeah. So if you rub the hair, yeah, it gains access to the circular yeah, part of the temple. And then here, yeah, if you rub the bottom of the cheek actually, yeah, so aside from yeah, relaxing the nerves there and massaging the nerve, yeah, they also what? Yeah, relax and open the sinuses. Yeah, so many points in the body. Yeah. <laughs> the body is uh, perfectly I say created, and when we just explore them, yeah, well, they could really help us manage the common yeah, pains, discomfort, and even yeah, some of the lingering health conditions yeah, we experience. Thank you, and I'll catch you in the next one. Master.